Hello everyone, welcome to Chess Basics. My name is Arvind. In this video, we'll see about the Tennyson Gambit. A wonderful gambit to win the opponent's queen for white if your opponent plays the Scandinavian defense. e4, d5, the Scandinavian defense. Knight f3, the Tennyson Gambit. This looks like it hangs the e-pawn. Well, that's the gambit. And black usually takes here a free pawn. The knight is attacked. Knight g5. Knight f6, defending the pawn on e4, d3, offering another pawn. A good rule of thumb is if your opponent offers a second pawn, it's best not to take it. So what happens if e takes on d3? Bishop takes d3. The best move for black is knight c6. But if h6 is played trying to kick the knight, the knight takes on f7 with a double threat to the queen and the rook. The king has to take. Now the winning move is bishop to g6 check. Going to g8 is not really an option. King has to take the bishop and there is no one to guard the back's queen. Queen takes queen, winning the game. As mentioned earlier, in this position, the best move here is knight c6. As this would defend the black's queen, so any sacrifice simply don't work. White will simply be down a lot of material for nothing. Let's now look at another variation. Instead of knight f6, queen d5 can be played. This defensive pawn also attacks the white's knight. Here the same reply as earlier. d3. This defends the knight with the bishop. Pawn takes pawn. Bishop takes pawn. Now looks like the g2 pawn is hanging. Queen takes pawn is a blunder. It looks good as it attacks the rook, but black is going to be the one down a rook. Bishop to e4, attacking the queen and defending the rook. Queen has to move, only safe square is g4. Now queen takes queen, bishop takes queen, bishop takes pawn, winning the rook in the corner. Hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please hit the like button and also share it with your family and friends. I wish you all the best in trying out this trap in your gameplay. And if you are new here, consider subscribing. I'll see you all in my next video.